Hello everyone, welcome to Quanta AI Lab. So today we learn about interesting software only, tool only. So we talk about focus. So if you are not comfortable with Comfy UI, so we are decided to make one more uh, video on the focus. This is one video which you learn about everything about focus in this video. So there are two things, two ways to use. One is this call app which I provided you in the description. You can download it. Second thing you can use of the Jarvis AI, but this will charge some amount. In Collab, this they will give you T4 some GPU for free. So you can just run this one and uh, I will show you how to open it, uh, focus and all how to do it. So let's go with the focus first one, which is paid. Before going to the main topic, so we are the Comfy developers and LLM developers. We make the video on Comfy UI every day. So hope you like, if you like the videos, just subscribe our channel by clicking the red button on it. So let's go on our today's topic. Before that, the Jarvis AI, which we use already for Comfy UI. So if we create an instance, first we need to create an instance. So already there is a Comfy UI instance. So we go to template, go to focus. So we use A5000. I show all two methods. Uh, first is this one. Then I will show you from the collab wall. Let's take a 20 and uh, oh, is standing name. Oh, and launch instance. It takes some time to allocate the instance. Uh, okay, it's done. Now, if we click on the focus, it gives us a bad gateway. It takes some time to set up the things. So once it is set up, let me show you the collab version also. Basically, it takes some time. So I will show you. You just I give you this collab notebook. You just open it. Uh, what is collab? So Google provide you uh, Jupyter notebook uh, interface. So you can search on the Google Google collab. Once you search it, welcome to collab Google. It will it is connected to your drive only. Okay, the so Google Drive. So they give you some free GPU. T4 GPU is mostly. So once we run it, just click on this button on the left side. Just click. So it starts setting some uh, dependencies already present in. It clones the focus from the GitHub. So where it takes, let me show you. So this is the directory we clone it here get cloned SDTB github by focus okay so this is the one which is made by this guy uh, we already knew about him because of the control net so he developed the, the SD 1.5 control net also okay so you, if you have a github profile you can follow this guy so these guys are making a lot of uh, things in the AI, AI image generation and all so this is the file we are using this one. This is the interface based. In ComfyUI we make everything, but here you need to write from, select the some settings and you can generate the images. Collab one is the free one. So if let me check. Okay, it takes models and all the things. It takes some time to load. Downloading some models already presented. Okay, so Jarvis AI Labs takes some time. So we will uh, work on this one. If once it is ready, so we will go on the Jarvis AI. So this is the Collab one, which is free. If you want to understand this commands, you can just copy paste on the chat GPT and ask it. Mostly this is for the git, taking things from the git and this is the content, this is the directory only. This is folder, it's like a folder and it's clone this thing in this folder. Okay, so we got, yeah. Once we click, this is the link, the running on the public URL. This is the link, once you click on this one, your focus is start this is an interface made made on the gradio built with gradio you see here so this is the basic interface where you in the right side you see the initial present quality speed extreme speed lightning hyper sd this is the performance on which you want to generate the images this is as aspect ratios which aspect ratio you want for example you want for your reels and something else you can choose and make it so let me take this one only Seven by nine. Okay. And number of images, for example, let's I take the four images. This is the negative prompt. You can write by quality 
you can write anything this is the history logs what you did in this one so it will take it from here history logs you can see here initial basically if you choose any other anime realistic lcm default pony v6 i lightning playground so this is the all the models it takes so in initial so let me show you some styles also focus v2 is the style if when you hover on that one this will show you the style for example here is this kit here is this kit so if we show semi realistic so it generated this one so you can see which style you want choose that style for example let's see on the focus masterpiece okay this one uh this is the only style one so you can choose according to you your needs and the next one this is the model part so in base model they are using juggernaut excel v8 run diffusion so we see this model on the cvti where you find the model it on the cvti only so go on the cvti you can find juggernaut excel wait let me go on the juggernaut excel this one so this is the model they are providing you can see the configurations for example you want to generate an image from here also you can take it the prompt from here directly this is the pro prompt okay let's take this one uh this is the negative prompt go on the settings this is the negative prompt okay then then this style you see the models we see this is the lora if you want to install any particular lora so you can use the, they are using sdxl offset definers also if you want to define the sdxl sd1.5 and advanced one this is the guidance how much guidance you want to give to the prompt 7 or maybe let's say 5 okay image sharpness okay let's generate some images a simple prompt okay so this is the prompt we give negative prompt also let's generate the image so if it's so secondly if you want any anime realistic you can click on that one or you can generate that one so once you click on other any other realistic so first it download the model you can see the model that model in this one and that will you need to only right click on the generate and for example your output format is png you want in jpg wpg you can go use, use this format also okay so this is the whole software basically you can just write a command and just generate there is some uh, advanced things just like import uh, if you want to particular trust so mostly for the ai influencer you can use this one this is the best out of all if you are using comfy as table diffusion or something if you want to particularly focus on the ai generation ai models influencer you or your particular niche is this one is similar face and with the different different dresses with different different places then you can use this tool this is free to use or you can generate the same face also so i will show you that also in that way yeah so we got four images an american girl with blue eyes sitting in a restaurant restaurant okay let me write the one let's see what it generates now and the whole process you can see here what is it doing in the terminal so you can watch it here just like requesting for this one this one you can understand this mod this model it takes so you can if you want to know about what is the process you can use that one okay so we got all four images which basically we number of images we give four so we got four images you can see here let's go on the one step more ahead so you see here there is a enhance button so it is used for the upscaling so if you want to upscale your any image for example this image or some anything else so 2x for example this dimension is we are using a expect ratio 7 9 so it doubles it with the same quality so there you can you upscale this image also let's go to the main part if you want to generate the similar image for example this girl we need to generate similar image or with other other activities so let's click on here uh, upscale and variation you want to so just drop it like for example 
image prompt okay with we need to play with the image and the prompt so for example this the image uploaded here we want this girl sitting on a beach this woman and let's generate it so there is also one advanced settings so once you click on the advanced setting just paste web so you can play with the weights also if you want more uh, just like similar more similar face you can increase that one and this is the different different images you can use if you have a lot of images of same person okay so jarvis is also set up once you click on this one you will see the same focus once you click on advanced you will see the on the right side you got the same thing which we we use in the collab also this is the interface only so let me check the models if they are using some different yeah so this this thing will give you the jarvis ai give you some extra models you can play with so mostly they are giving you the sdxl models so you can use any model or just run it and this is the quality anime you want you can click on anime it starts downloading the model and you can create your anime character also so we do face swap for this one so we wait for some time it will generate our output so this way you can shift this face swap on the any location you want you want and the italy or something just write a prompt and you got it okay let's see what what we let's uh in painting on this this image let's in paint something on this image so this is also we can do okay so for in painting you just need to click on in paint just drop it so what you want to let's uh we are in the necklace okay just generate it uh i'll make create one image only you see uh, after in painting we see the necklace on her neck so this way you can in paint anything for example you want red eyes you can uh, just write here red eyes so once it is done just generate it yeah you see here so after some of the upscaling and all the different things you can find out your so you can use focus like this so you can try it with anime any other style you want so try it comment us if you did you try or not focus so this is the easiest way to generate image for your ai influencer and all the things anime characters so you can try if you don't have much time to use comfy ai and all things So hope you like this video. If you like the video, subscribe our channel. We come up with the, some amazing videos on LLMs, AI models, which we use in the generative AI field. If we have projects, if we find someone good who writes the good comment, or if you are following with the, from the start things and write a good comment about what you learned from this channel, we will definitely connect with you guys. So hope you like the subscribe our channel. Thank you.